After years of living under a dark cloud in the United States, 2015 was shaping up to be the year affordable diesel-powered passenger vehicles would make a serious mark. Volkswagen, long a torchbearer for the technology in America, was reporting strong sales, Mazda was working to certify its Euromarket diesel, General Motors was readying its second-gen 2017 Chevrolet Cruze diesel, and several other manufacturers were, for the first time in decades, studying the viability of diesels for stateside duty. Then, as if on cue, the VW diesel scandal broke and it was back to square one. But while VW was busy cleaning up its mess and Mazda continues to fiddle with its entry, the Chevrolet Cruze diesel hit the streets running clean. EPA-compliant diesel vehicles also are available from BMW, Jaguar, and Land Rover, but they cost thousands more and attract a different demographic. GM's turbo diesel 1.6-liter inline-4 engine is now available in the dramatically improved, new Ford 2018 Equinox Compact Crossover, 2, so we snagged one to see if it's a genuine fuel sipper with usable bottom-end grunt or just a clattery addition to the 1.5 and 2.0-liter 4-cylinder gasoline engines already in the lineup. Let's get this out of the way up front, if you are standing next to the diesel Equinox when it fires up from a cold slumber, there's no mistaking that a compression ignition engine is under the hood. The cabin is substantially louder at idle we measured 43 decibels in the diesel versus 39 in an Equinox 1.5T but that additional hum isn't obnoxious or off-putting. And as the engine warms to operating temperature, even its outside bark grows subdued, and the masses will be none the wiser to the absence of spark plugs under the hood.